elementary school staff are hoping to paint the town yellow for hashtag yellow for Darnell to support beloved first grade teacher Darnell Clark as she recovers from COVID-19. The trend started with Clark's friends from college reaching out to the school to further the reach. She really makes her kids feel loved. She makes them feel like they're part of a family. And um, she also does that with the staff. Individuals are asked to wear yellow, Clark's favorite color, and post a picture on social media with the hashtag yellow for Darnell so that others and Clark can see it. Kohler said it's a fitting color because Clark is a ray of sunshine to all those around her. She's always just like happy and fun. You know, she has a way of making everything just bright and sunshiny. Um, you could be having a bad day and one of the kids could be having a bad day and she just makes it better for them. Kohler also said the support has found its way outside state lines and that a school in Tennessee posted a photo dressed in yellow in support of Clark. And that's just a true testament of who she is as an educator and a person and an individual. Positivity is one of the many words Kohler and fellow teachers use to describe Clark and something they see her give to the community and school. Her positive energy and just her, you know, she's able to connect to all the students and staff around here in the community as well. She's always able to find the positive in everything. Um, she's always, you know, looking out for other people. If there's a way that she can help, she always tries to step in and help in any way she can. Current and former students and staff and even the school therapy dog, Paws, have been sending Clark messages of support and letting her know how much they love her and hope the rest of the community can join in tomorrow by wearing yellow. We love you, Darnell. See, that was good. You guys were good. Clark also went viral this year for her teaching videos. The link to that story is below. In Liberty for WKBN 27 First News, I'm Brandon Jaycees.